All right, Jess, once we have that, um, we're going to add clone the Dimension Pro and we're adding um, the bell itself is cool, right? We got like basically the main sound of it uh, for the most part. Now, uh, the other thing we want to add to it is um, it's in our percussion section. It's just a triangle and we're using the triangle mid. You guys obviously should know what a triangle is. Um, real simple. And we're just going to go ahead and um, actually, we're, we have changed this pattern just a bit. Like this last part, if you listen to the beat, he has it kind of just like repeating like this. Oops. Uh, CTRL-C, CTRL-V, copy and paste. So we actually have this. Okay. Uh, now, uh, that sound is cool by itself, but I just wanted to be a little sharper, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to take this triangle to the piano roll, and we'll just be playing the C-sharp note. Or it might be higher. We just need, we don't need like that huge triangle sound. We just need that beginning. Okay, so that's cool. Uh, and then the last thing uh, I want to add in here is in hyper canvas. This is the sound I found in here, and I just felt like it fit. Um, it just made it kind of sound just in my head, just kind of closer to what he had. And I think it's called a Santer. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Kind of like an ethnic type sound um and we're gonna make sure that's on pattern two as well we might actually take this off pattern two okay and we're gonna go ahead and copy the same pattern from the first uh, bell down to here Okay, and what it does is like the bell itself doesn't have like a lot of melodic tone to it, but this sound does, and it's still kind of crisp and sharp, so it just works um, in there well. I felt like it just complemented it well, um, so we kept that. So that basically would come in over here. So that's kind of what we have so far. We might actually just take pattern three out. Uh, I just don't like that. Okay, so that's cool. And uh, one thing we might do is just let's drag this back a little bit. Okay, so uh, something like that. So that's cool uh, for the first melody part of it. Let's jump to the next section and start working on the drums. 